another 17 minutes be part two I'm 20th day of July year 2023 8.01 uh, a.m. I don't know if I'll, I got to talking fast because I was down to the wire uh, on my record time it's got 17 minutes and 40 seconds to record on this one uh, I don't even know if I got much to say really other than soon enough I I'm gonna have to quit talking about the I don't know the phones hinted close to fall 22 uh, tubal litigation reversal reinfected with HIV um, selling eggs very lucrative a certain place not far from here off of Sulphur Springs Road was the midwife birthing center uh, keep in mind this is like within two months of the, the, the last time I see this woman is that I dated year 2018 2019 is that she leaves here August the 10th uh, 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 2022 it will soon it will soon be a, a month a couple of weeks I mean a year a full year haven't seen her since then um, she left in a white Camaro um, the next day, she, she left with my crack screen Nokia that I bought Walmart, Mina, Arkansas, June 2021. First ever smartphone for my longtime 3651 number. Uh, I saw the phones done some crazy stuff starting summer 2021. Earlier that year, I signed up with Norton LifeLock. First week of February 2021, I signed up for with Identity Guard. And the only reason I did that is because I had trouble getting the Norton LifeLock thing to renew, but they would just say, like, wait 24 hours. And then people, somewhere on Facebook, first half of 2021, uh, 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 I'd read a post. It'd be like, Norton LifeLock doesn't help, or it just all they do is take your money. Uh, Anyway, it's, it's like it's like in retrospect. I mean, I could timeline it more efficiently. I may not have the time here. Uh, to say that I'm going to do pretty good without saying names. Regarding the, the relationship, the woman I dated, 2018, 2019. In regard to the thought of a, a secret pregnancy. I mean, this woman, I, she had drug abuse issues. You might say worse than me uh, without getting into that. She's, I mean, and lots of people knew it through, the, through this area. Her longtime boyfriend before me, longtime so-called mother-in-law before my mother, they all they knew it, man. She she filed for Social Security disability of her her idea here, summer 2008. It wasn't even my idea. She first applies for CG Roxanne next door. I'm even telling her like I had an Oldsmobile in the yard. I hadn't got it going yet. 1997 Oldsmobile, Oldsmobile Regency. I said, well, if you do get hired over there, I said I'll. Uh, I'll trim out the path. I said, I'll try to make it where you can go over there without even having to touch the state highway because she didn't have a driver's license. Let's just say similar to me. Something associated to unpaid fines and things like that. Like to, supposedly if I got caught driving today in, in, a, in, a, in a vehicle insured, registered, uh, without an interlock in it, I'm supposed to be subjected to an automatic 10 days in jail. The only thing is you may not have to do it consecutive. But it's like state mandatory law, Arkansas. You got, I've done it before, and I, I, I don't want to do it again anyway. I don't remember what I all wrote to, to Social Security, but um, I, I wrote that follow-up letter. I'd have to read the, my deal. I, 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 in September 2018, I, I implied I had some pills missing out of the bottle. And that the only person that was here to do it could have been her. Clonopin. I did. Okay, the woman. Okay, I don't remember when the Social Security disability was first sent off. August the sixteenth, August seventeenth, somewhere, you know, past the middle of August two thousand eighteen. So, with, shortly after that being sent off, she leaves for five days to go to be with her boyfriend of almost five years before me. I give her, due to conversations over the phone. I give her, I try to give her a free pass, if you will. She'd be like, I, I mean, I'm, I'm standing in that yard one day on my, my flip phone. She's like, I'm going to regret this for a long time. She's like, I know I got a history with the bad boys, but you've treated me 
different than anybody else. I'm nervous about it. It goes through my mind. I've picked up over the years. Uh, she, she's not alive anymore, but going back farther in years, uh, late Shannon Bates. I, I've seen her at a place she'd stay in Cata Gap, like <laughs> having to renew, get a new direct express card or something. I learned from her that her location or change of address was real a big deal to uh, like Social Security or Social Security disability. Uh, anyway... <laughs> Anyway, it's hard for me to remember the timing of this. I think it was it was either very late 2018 unless it's early 2019. She, she comes out of the shower one day. This is during the daylight hours. She's going to the closet door. And she says about her weight. She's going up in weight. Uh, she uh, she said, looks at me and she says, I blame you. If that woman knew she is pregnant, that is that is heartless, heartless. That is cruel. There is something about this woman I never knew. That is a cruel, cruel woman. Greedy, greedy. She she's complaining before the end of two thousand after adoption papers are sent here. She's talking about how she hates her older sister. She can't believe she's doing this to her. I guess the whole thing was set up. It's like where do these people go for their training? Where do they go? It's like part, I, I could go, the, the baby ring I showed in another video, not if I ever do this part two. It's like, what, sell it? It's a baby ring that my, my mother was born September 1950. I believe she was born in Mena, Arkansas. Uh, I've had that since I was younger than 12. There might be a piece of it over there, the, the 100 year rocker. I've, I've been frustrated, irritated. I burned it. Why? I ain't got a toddler kid. Do I? No. Never will, I guess. I, I don't guess I won't even. I, I, <laughs> I just want to see if I saw a piece of that chair I've burned since then. I've had that chair. I always thought if I ever had a kid, they'd sit in that chair. I guess. I've never really imagined I'd ever have a kid. I don't. They stole my kid if I got one. Don't know who, don't know how, probably lesbians. Probably a close by neighbor, I don't know. Surely not Andy Reiner, surely not Brian Johnson, surely not her lesbian sister that lives in or near Little Rock, or what is it, Van Buren? Hell, I don't know. And that's something that the phones would say, even late last year. I asked, like, where did she go? Like, X, I can't say her name. They wouldn't let me, I'm like, where did, close to fall, it'd be like, she's in Van Buren. It'd say Van something. Close to fall of 2000 and, uh, uh, 22. This woman, is, look, these people didn't even show up. For her shirt that how many times did these people even visit her when she for the five years that she's with her boyfriend before me i even thought that the week of surgery the day of surgery i'm like i'm like isn't her mom supposed to already be out of florida like why does these people not even visit her when she gets here before the end she's like, why do these people soundboard I ain't got nothing. I ain't got any good news on this. I ain't got any news. Are you looking at it from my perspective? I don't got any good news over this. I'm a single man, no wife. I'm talking about a woman that I would have married, had rings in the Walmart.com, shopping a cart before the end of 2018, early 2019, told the woman we should do a legal marriage. What I'm swaying. What good news I got out of this who's that pulling over speeding oh they slowed down for a dog a little dog in the center of the road it's going that way I guess that's a little dog not one of mine I tried to send her a message on City Telecoin. 
post last week of June 2023. That didn't work. I'm just spinning my wheels. Hell, I'm not even, I plan to try to upload this. I thought earlier, I'll just wait, keep the stuff on here. I was gonna try to upload it on YouTube. It take forever. These that, the one I took earlier. It was two, it's right over two gigabytes. That takes a long time, even over there with more signal. I, I was saying out loud here whether I recorded it on something or not. By fall 2022, three fall. 2022 soon be, soon enough be a year i was like i, I want to meet her with the kid I, I i got like excited due to the phone hints i'm like oh they want me to meet the kid maybe there's not one i don't know maybe there's not i can't lie to myself i, I pretty much know it is fact that she is pregnant uh 2019 did not know it then i let's just say buyer before the end of summer 2021 i timeline it i go over it and i mean i'm like i'm shocked i'm like whoa man they take her they sedate her they do a c-section they take the baby what happened after that i don't know that's an eagle flying a bald eagle soaring I didn't even ask her much about this last year. I, I brought it up to her some. I showed her, showed her the, the green bracelet. I, I, I First, I'm just saying, like, you can have it if you want it, but I'm like, I'd like to keep it. I did say a little bit of commentary early, early last year, but I didn't, I didn't question her, question her. There goes somebody. No even look, no even wave. Why is he, what do you do, turn around? He is. Hell, I just hit the deal. He's, he's going to either turn around or he's going to get water. Probably get water. I'll say this. I think it's the alias name. I'm not that I'll ever upload this. Who is Brad Cruz? She had an Arkansas registration in this house said Brad Cruz on it. B-R-A-D space like C-R-U-Z. I have my suspicions of who I think it is, uh, but I won't I won't get into that in case I ever do upload this. I mean, she, I didn't take a, I don't even think I ever took a photo of it or anything. I mean, she had it laid out in the living room. Uh, Arkansas, like Department of Finance Administration, tags, registration for a vehicle. And something would say uh, an address like Malvern, Arkansas or Ranger. I asked her uh, after she had her doctor's appointment, left here scat van, July the 18th, 2022. We're in, we're in Mena, Arkansas. We already left Walmart. I just asked her, I said, who were you in love with the most, Brad or the boyfriend before him? Somebody that she dated from like year 2013 to spring 2018. I'm like, which one were you more in love with? And she said, Brad. And I said, why? She says, I guess we didn't, we bonded differently. She used the word bonded. Anyway, lots of time has passed. Uh, I, it, it just got me perplexed. I'm, I'm drinking beer with last night. He's above the age of 60. He just like, he's like, if a woman's pregnant, she's going to drink a lot of milk. And I'm like, she did. She always, she, this is so peculiar. I don't have enough time to record on this to talk about it. Um, Early on, you know, I, I found out that she had physical insecurities about her body, even though before her weight went up, you, when she gets here in like June, July, 2018, she's like, she says, she's like, I don't take pills like I used to. I'm like, that's good. I already knew she had a history of the drug methamphetamine. So as it gets closer to the end of 2018, her weight's going up. I'm thinking, okay, she, she's in her mid thirties. She's getting closer to 40. She's, I've already seen photos of her mother. She's going to have a build like her mother. She's going to go up and wait. It is what it is. I was accepting it. I mean, early on, to say it plainly, the woman didn't even, during intercourse, she didn't even like to totally unclothe. And she acted like she was like that with men prior to me. I had to work to get her out of that. And I was pretty respectful about it. 
I'm saying, you know, I'm just to say it plainly, like during intercourse, I'm like belly, stomach to stomach, I'm feeling a shirt. I mean, just, I'm just going to say it plainly, like an adult. She, she would take her, her breast out. She'd take them, she'd like drop her up from above her shoulders. She'd, she'd remove her breasts. I, she, I'm saying before fall of 2018, the woman exhibited insecurity about her belly, her body, and then bam, you know, by, by May of May or June 2019, she's above 220 pounds. I see that on like the, uh, the, the second or third visit to the Dr. Michael Crowgrove. When we'd leave the waiting room, we'd go into his medical assistant's office. She's like five foot five, brown hair, um, uh, she said her, when she looked at her, the first day we met her, she's like, I'm Brie too. My name is Brie also. Ah, oh, see, I said that much, but she's saying like B-R-E-E. -E. Uh, I, I have, maybe that's an alias. Probably. I, I wrote this explicitly later on when she had the attorney, Donna M. Price. I, I, I'm, I, I'm saying in like early 2020, I'm like, I think she's got battered women's syndrome. <laughs> uh, uh, anyway, she exhibited major insecurities about her, about her body. Let's just say before fall of, uh, 2018 and before her, uh, weight went up. I have no choice but to believe when I timeline it, I'm almost out of time on this. Uh, the woman was pregnant and that hence I've gotten since it had to be by me. And that, 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 that delivery happened or that sur surgical delivery happened. If it did June the 28th, 2019 with a doctor, I highly do not recommend. And I don't know if there was ever a, a Dr. Michael Cogrove. Um, I don't know if there's ever a tubal litigation somewhere, uh, a tubal litigation reversal somewhere along the way to allow pregnancy. And if somebody did do that, think of their, their desperation of whatever they hope to get out of it, of a, of a kid. You, they pre-planned the, the father, apparently. Like, we, how, how do they even go about this? Like, did they, somebody actually coach this woman, live here with him, get pregnant by him, You'll know when it's time. It's like in, in the backyard in, in like April or May of 2019. The, the, the red camp king chairs that I ordered off of walmart.com. Her idea. She's like, oh, spring is coming. I want some good lawn chairs. She just pops 